We like to focus on niche business. Most of our niche customers are going to be OEM, original equipment manufacturers, and we're making a specialized component that goes into their assembly or into their machine to be used in whatever industry that they happen to be in. We're a rack manufacturer, we're a gear manufacturer, and we're a machining company as well. We become a little bit more of a one-stop shop for our customers. I think Chris and Ivan knew that their opportunity to grow their gear business was there, and they were right on the cusp of doing that, but they really needed something to help them do that, some modern CNC gear cutting equipment. And, you know, we knew that they knew gearing and they knew hobs and they knew processes and how to make everything, and so it was a good relationship and a good partnership to, to strike up with them. Machine came in, we powered it up the next day, and Helios was in the following day to start training and start installing everything. So really from the time that it hit our floor, we were probably running our first part three days later. That machine is probably, at a minimum, cut half the time out of our runs. I mean, we knew this was gonna happen. I mean, it's just made us so much more productive. There's jobs that lasted probably a week. We're knocking them out in, you know, two days or even less that we're running two shifts. So it's just it's been a game changer for us. So we ran seven jobs back to back on the same arbor, and all we had to do was go up to, to the control and change the number of teeth. Never had to change the work arbor, never had to change the hob. But because of the CNC control and the accuracy of the machine, we just put in exactly what size we wanted and we ran seven jobs and cut them all in a matter of hours. We were able to check them immediately in our CNC gear checker and everything was spot on right where it needed to be. They've been able to get rid of six of those machines. Uh, the efficiency, the throughput of the Hera 90 has replaced six old hovers. So if I can take an old machine out, and I can put a new machine in that has less floor space, but can outperform them from an accuracy and an efficiency standpoint, that's a no-brainer. We're, we're doing that every step of the way that we get a chance.